Uh, this is uh, the crossing fields uh, where my father was killed. He had kettles and, and, and some coats uh, in this crossing field. The cat rustlers from the neighborhood came and shot him dead. I was uh, six years old at that time. This is the story I've been given by my mother, who witnessed uh, the body of the father yeah, around this grazing field. When I was 13, that's the first time I hold a, a farm in my hand. When you hold that farm, that tells you that you are a man enough to fight with a man. This is the Rio River, the border between our neighbors and us, Marakwit. There is no any farming taking place along this valley because now it is a, it is a war place where the, the, the cattle rustlers meet. Uh, they fight along this uh, bush. They come, they take ours, we come, take theirs. Uh, funny, it was like a football, you know, a premier where you, you score a goal, I score also on that side. Mm. One morning, my mother came. We were taking tea, and Mom was telling me that, uh, "Do you know? Do you know that you want to a, a secondary school, luckily?" Like I said to my mom, "Yes." She she told me that uh, I have never seen who has ever been abandoned in the family, so you can't be the one. I want you to actually be disciplined. I want you to actually change your life, and. My son will go far. You come back and you are not ready. 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 Education actually is everything because when you, you communicate to someone who went to school, you talk the same mind. Football has played a very big role in enhancing peace in, in the Kerry Valley. Football, you can't play alone. You play with the, the neighbors so that you measure yourself with your neighbors on how, how far have you gone in terms of playing football. And as a, as a matter of fact, we bring them closer to us. We got to discuss the challenges that, uh, that affects uh, youth uh, at large. Playing football is one way of promoting peace. Amani, <laughs> <laughs>